Hey everybody, welcome back to the Fragrance Channel, and today we're going to be doing a fragrance review over Daisy Dream by Marc Jacobs. So the box is a light blue, and it has this floral look around the edges. In the mid-center, we have a gold rim, and it is metallic. And then on the inside of that rim, it is light blue and says Daisy Dream by Marc Jacobs. And it tells you what ounce I got. I got a 1.0 fluid ounce. So the side has the ingredients. And then the back has a full picture of the perfume bottle. And then the other side is just blank. And then the top opens, obviously, and it says Daisy Dream by Marc Jacobs. So the box opens relatively easy, just like so, and the perfume is in inside. So to start off the fragrance review, I'm going to show you guys the bottle up close. So here's the bottle. It says Daisy Dream on it by Marc Jacobs. It has the, these white 3D flowers that pop off the base of the bottle. And they go all the way around. There's a 360 of the bottle. And then we have this golden rim under the cap. And then we just have a plain cap. If you would have gotten the 1.7 ounce bottle, um, it would have flowers on it just like the base of the bottle does. And it would have gold inside the middle of the flowers. I got this as a Christmas gift, so I'm not going to complain. But it would have been awesome, you know, have flowers on the cap. But, you know, it's not a big deal. But if you're interested in that, go for it. The reason why I really like these bottles are mainly because um, just in the collection in general every perfume he's done in this collection dot honey daisy daisy dream so on and so forth has this 3d pop to it which is really neat and if you're a big bottle collector um, you definitely want to get these bottles so we're gonna have a close-up of it so here is a close-up of the bottle. As we can see, it's as I described before, but up even closer. <laughs> and there I am in the cap. So the perfume has this light blue tinting to it. I don't know if you guys can see it. But it does have a tint to it. It's a gorgeous bottle. And I'm sorry if the camera color is kind of dingy on this. I am using my phone to do the review, so, I mean, it has a good camera and a good focus, but it just dilutes the color and the brightness of the video. So I'm sorry if it's kind of yellowish looking. But that is the cap in the bottle up close. I don't know why I said cap. I guess I was thinking about the cap because I see myself. I don't know. But yeah, so that's the bottle up close. Um, so the notes for this perfume. Top notes are blackberry, grapefruit, and pear. Mid notes, jasmine, lishy, blue asteria. Base notes, white woods, musks, and coconut water. So those are the notes of the perfume. So thank you guys for watching. Um, also, if you're interested, they came out with a gift set this year that I'm pretty positive they would still have in stock, maybe. And it just has three of the Daisy fragrances. Daisy So Fresh, Daisy, Daisy Dream, and you can get it in the Rollerball, which can be a cheaper alternative if you really like this perfume. 
you know, but don't want to put out that much money for it. So here's the gift set right here. And I will leave a link in the description for that review because I did it like a few weeks ago. So yeah. So thank you guys for watching. And I hope you guys are interested in this perfume because it is really good. Before I forget to mention what it smells like to me. Um, it's the best way to put this. It is, I would say... Sweet, floral, and has a hint of musk, but it's not overpowering, so it's a balance of both. It's really good. I really, really, really enjoy it. It's one of my favorites. It's just a fresh scent. There goes the cat. <laughs> oh, it just smells so good. It's worth buying, I'm telling you. And I don't know what the lasting time for it is like if you put it on I don't know how long it's gonna stay on you all I know is I keep usually I keep the rollerball in my bag wherever I go so thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this little fragrance review and